Mother Aphrodite, can you teach me how to love? Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a beach makeup tutorial kind of thing. So right now I am in Boracay and I'm in my hotel room and I'm about to get ready for the day. So I decided why not just um, show you guys my routine. So the first thing that I'm putting on is sunscreen. Hold on. So I'm just going to put this on my face. This is an essential. You guys are supposed to always Wear sunscreen even if you're not going to the beach. If you guys are interested in going to Boracay, just note that at the moment it's November 2nd and there is still a lot of construction going on. Um, and there's not a lot of, no, a lot of shops are still closed down because they're not um, approved or accredited by Boracay. And also a lot of hotels. So that's just something to note, but um, on the plus side, there is very few people here. Um, so there, if you guys are interested, then just take note of that. So next, um, so when I want to apply my makeup for the beach, I do not like putting on a base just in case um, I decide to like, like to go for a swim or like at the beach so it's very important that you prioritize your skincare when you're doing your beach makeup so what I did before um, my sunscreen is I applied uh, I just washed my face and then I applied moisturizer um, a water-based moisturizer just so it sticks to your skin and then um, my sunscreen so next I'm going to be doing my eyebrows I'm using this one from AOA. So, just be applying this real quick. Also, when I uh, do my eyebrows, I like to go for a lighter color when I'm at the beach because when I tend to use something that's darker than my hair color or darker than my eyebrows, then it kind of doesn't fit, it doesn't look natural. So I like to go for more of a brownish shade when I'm going for just an everyday look or if I'm just going to uh, go to the beach. I also like to use an eyebrow pencil instead of like a pomade. Pomades tend to be, um, to apply darker. And I think that eyebrow pencils are easier to use, especially if you're on the go. I don't have a big mirror, so I'm having a hard time checking if, it's, if it looks alright. We're gonna stick with that. So, um, next is I'm going to be applying some. Okay. I kind of wanna do like eyeshadow, but like something that's just very natural and very light. Oh, I actually have a bigger one. So I do have my um, just a small uh, palette. This is the one I always use on my channel. And then I also have this um, Mathematic lipstick from EB Advanced. So this is what it looks like right inside. Yeah, this is what it looks like. I do really like the shade and this is what I use to apply on my eye on my eyelids and it looks pretty okay. So I'm just going to apply like a decent amount and then I'm going to just spread that in. You can use any other uh, lipstick or even use your eyeshadow, that's fine. going to focus this more on the outer parts of my lid. Um, I also don't prime my lids anymore when I'm at the beach um, or when I'm doing like an everyday makeup. I also just bought one brush in my kit. So this one is what I'm going to be using. This shade. Then I'm just going to lightly dust it all over my lids.
or if I'm on the go, I won't be applying this shade anymore. I just want to apply this just so it looks more well blended out. So, I think that looks okay now. Actually, I want to kind of conceal a little bit on my under eyes. Since I've been sick recently and it's just been really dark on my under eyes, just very lightly. Just gonna let that sit and then I'm going to be blending that out with my finger. So when you're traveling, you don't really want to bring like a lot of brushes or a lot of makeup. Also, if you haven't, or I'm not sure if that video is up already, but um, I do have another video or a vlog. I'm sorry if it's noisy outside. Um, I'm right by the pool, so if it's noisy and you hear a lot of children screaming, that's why. But if you haven't, I still have another vlog coming up. Um, it's my Barakai vlog, so if you guys want to check out what Barakai looks like or if you just want to support me, then just check that out. Um, also, if you guys are wondering, what I'm wearing right now is this bikini. This is from Happy Joni, and I got this one from UP Down from the Bent House. And they have really good bikinis, so if you guys want to check that out. Um, and then I think I'll just be. S oh no, I don't have powder. So I don't have powder, so we're just gonna stick with that. Um, this concealer, you don't really have to set it because it does dry up a bit matte. And don't, pl don't apply a lot na lang if you don't have powder like me. Um, okay, so now I'm going to be putting on some mascara. So at the beach, you do want like something that's waterproof. And I'm using this one from Heroin Make. Heroin Make. This one is super waterproof. Literally, it stays on the whole day. This one is there. Volume and Curl Mascara. I know they have like different types and different shades. I think this one, they have the black and the brown, but I'm using the black one today. I'm just going to be curling my lashes. Also, if you guys have noticed this improved quality of the camera and the audio, it's because I did get new gear. <laughs> gear didn't get a new camera and then a new mic. I'm using the Boya mic. And then my camera is this new EOS Rebel SL2. Uh, so that's why. So if you guys can see, I'm not sure if you guys can see my lashes, but they do look way better. So compare these two eyes. And this thing, it lasts the entire day, so that's probably the best thing about this mascara. It stays up the entire day, especially for someone like me who has like lashes that go straight down. Best mascara ever, okay? So now we are moving on to the cheeks. I'm going to be using my lip and cheek tint from KJM. This is what I always use. So I'm just going to be applying this on my cheeks. Then blend that out. And then I'm going to be applying on my lips. So now I'm going to be applying my highlight. This one is the Physician's Formula one that I always use. Physician's Formula one that I always use. I'm going to be applying that with an eyeshadow eye, eye brush. This is actually the finished look, you guys. So you can add like bronzer if you want, like if you want to add foundation, whatever. But this is how I like to do my beach makeup look. It's very natural I guess you could say 
Um, so this is what it looks like. So thank you guys so much for watching my video. If you guys liked it, don't forget to leave a like down below and subscribe. Um, if you guys have any video suggestions, then just leave it in the comment section down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to watch my other videos. And I'll see you guys on the next one.